Several people living in a Ripon neighborhood are having a hard time sleeping, all because of a pesky bug that doesn't seem to want to go away. It's, it's gross. It's gross. You try to sleep at night, you kind of itch. You know, it's, it's not normal. Neighbors say they have spotted thousands of cockroaches from sidewalks to their porches and sometimes even in their own beds. The problem area is along Jack Tone Road between Main and 4th Streets. New at 6, CBS 13's Carlos Correa is in Ripon to show us the problem. People in this quiet neighborhood say they are fed up and have created this sign to express just how they feel. This is the video that's catching the attention of a lot of neighbors living on Jack Tone Road. It shows homeowner Dave Drowdy and his wife outside keeping the cockroaches at bay. It's not a few. It's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. The couple has lived in the neighborhood for more than 30 years. Just recently, they posted a sign that reads Cockroach Alley to let city leaders know they want action. My boy's uh, girlfriend was here one night and all of a sudden you hear her screaming. You know, it's like, cockroach running across the bed. Is that gross or what? I mean, you know, uh, I find them in the bathroom, find them all over. Drowdy says most of the bugs are coming from the sewer line in front of his driveway. City crews did spray the manhole and sealed the holes on the cover, but neighbors say it's a temporary solution. It's ridiculous, man. It's, every, it's everywhere. You know, you look around and you just see them crawl over the place. Pest control specialists say there are two common cockroaches spotted around the valley. The German cockroach that multiplies after invading kitchens and bathrooms. The other is the oriental cockroach that lives in sewers and down in the ground. They're a nocturnal insect, which means they sleep during the day. So when the sun comes up, they're going for the near shade. So they're going to find harbage areas like under boards, heavy shrubs, uh, things that clutter that you could have on the outside. And then as the population grows, they start to invade the home. To control the insects, experts say keep areas clean and clear and seal cracks and holes. How you, underneath the doors, you have a threshold, a little rubber piece. Make sure that that seals good. Neighbors here say they will continue to spray and hope the city can do something more to help control the problem. Yeah, let's hope so, Carlos. Thanks.